Hello, graduates, guests, and platform party. I should probably start by introducing myself. So as they said, uh, my name is Maxi. My pronouns are they, them. I change my hair color pretty much every other week. And my favorite food is basically anything with an obscene amount of garlic in it, to be honest. Um, and basically, I'm here because I've been, unfortunate, I've, been, <laughs> I've been fortunate enough to enjoy five years of education here at Staffordshire University. Basically, back when I was decided what I wanted to do for my career, I'd always just respond with, I'm not really sure yet, I just really want to make a difference to something. My career goals basically changed every week. Outside of this concept of making a difference, I was just completely lost with where I wanted to take my future. Between figuring out my gender identity and attempting to find where I fit within the adult, career-centered world, I spent the year before I enrolled at Staffordshire University in basically a permanent state of confusion. In March 2016, I came out as transgender non-binary to my lovely, brilliant, and supportive family. For those of you who aren't sure what non-binary is, it basically means that I don't identify as male or female, I'm just me. Six months later, in September 2016, I enrolled onto the BA Cartoon and Comic Arts and began working as a student communications ambassador and student blogger here at Staffordshire University. And within weeks, I'd figured out two extremely important things. Number one, cheese is a lot more expensive than you think. And number two, the staff at this university are some of the most incredible, supportive people I've ever met. With the help of the Staffordshire University community, I graduated with not only a first class honors in cartoon and comic arts, but also a master's in esports. But on top of this, I was also given the opportunity to do and be so much more. Over the last five years, I've self-published two comic books, sold my work at the biggest comic convention in the UK, helped four years worth of prospective students enter the university through clearing, hosted a graduation live stream show, grown my online presence to over 200,000 followers, presented four award ceremonies, met and interacted with people of all different ages, experiences, and backgrounds, and been able to share this whole student journey across the so Staffordshire Uni social media platforms. I couldn't have done any of these things without Staffordshire University. Between my courses and my job, staff's encouraged me to grow, not only as a professional, but as a person, allowing me to be unapologetically me, publicly and safely. So, if I'm a cartoon and comic arts and esports graduate, why am I stood up here during a life sciences and education ceremony? Well, because the members of staff that I mentioned earlier, they didn't just help me to fulfill my potential, they also inspired me to pursue what I now see as one of the most powerful career paths, education. Thank you to those lecturers, I decided to explore teaching and through my PGCE in post-compulsory education and training, fell in love with adult education, leading to my current position as an esports lecturer here at Stats. So yes, when I was deciding what career I wanted to pursue, I'd always respond with, I don't know yet, I just want to make a difference to something. And today I can say with confidence that Staffordshire University has helped me to achieve that. So I think I speak on behalf of every graduate in this room when I say a massive thank you to our amazing lecturing staff. You encouraged us to be curious and daring in our pursuit of success and our ambition has been fueled by your inspirational approach to education and research. Every graduate in this hall has been affected by your passion, patience and guidance and we will carry that with us for a lifetime. Graduates, please join me now in a show of support for our amazing lecturers, technical and support staff. Please clap your hands, stomp your feet as loudly as you can, make the room come alive so that they can feel your appreciation. Thank you.